Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with Vintage Story, and I am here just real close to my base. Had a lot of things happen. I've been doing some things, getting used to how to play the game. I did die, however. I got attacked by a wolf. Went down in the cave, didn't see him. He snuck up behind me, and I was done in, and I lost all kinds of stuff, but I've managed to get a lot of it back, but... I want to show you that little structure that I had built. Well, I've been making some serious improvements to it. And I know it's still pretty much a box. <laughs> but it is better. And I've been able to get some crops. and Well, not really crops going. I planted some bushes and stuff. But all these bushes around here are different types of berries. So food is not really an issue right now. I've got cranberries over here. I've got blueberries along here and up here. And I just planted those because they're pretty, but I think eventually I'm going to need them. And if I come around here, I've got some red currants, and black currants are over here. So there's plenty of food. I'm going to go ahead and get a little bit of it because I'm going to need it. There we go. And I also planted a whole bunch of cattails both in and out of the water, and I'm probably going to put a, even more. I got another cattail here that I picked up along the way. Might as well go ahead and plant it somewhere along here. I think I'll just put this one on the shore, just like that. And I'm going to, here's some mature carrots. Go ahead and grab them. I'm not going to mess with the growing the growing carrots because I kind of want to get them for food. But, here we go, guys. I was purposely not looking up, but there's my little structure up there. As a matter of fact, I just was able to get some stairs. No, I didn't. I lost it, too. <laughs> I forgot about it. But I put a few stairs in here. And we're going to go ahead and dig this out. This is to keep the drifters from coming in when I'm away. But as you can see, I've kind of hollowed out all of this. This is just... It's two blocks up so the drifters can't get in. And I basically built it so that I can poke them in the face. So that I can kill them. <laughs> but none of them can get in here this way. They can only get in that way if they choose to. And I have a ladder up here. And I've got more bushes. These are more black currants, red currants. And here's my little home. Well, this one's already starting to flower. But, I mean, it's really just a box, I know, and I don't even have a door yet. But, hey, it's a start, and I've got some reed baskets going. So, not too bad. And I even have a couple of, uh, of tool racks here, which I've got some extra tools thrown up there so that I can grab them. And I don't, I don't want to carry all my tools because I don't want to die again and lose them. But there's something that I am pretty proud of right here. Let me show you this this guy here. This is a copper prospecting pick. Now I probably should have created a real pick. I didn't find that out until later. But it can break blocks. But it was the first thing I smelted. I wanted to try doing it before I show you guys how to do it. But it detect apparently it detects deposits that are above 2.5 percent concentration level. It does not register surface copper, quartz, rock salt, or lapis lazuli. Lazuli, but it doesn't do too bad, and it is a tier tool tier number two. But its durability is already a little bit down. And copper doesn't last that long. And when I was also checking a few things out, I don't know as you can tell, I've got some seeds here, which I think I've got some to put back in here. Yeah, I do. I'm gonna start gardening some real soon here, guys. And where did I do it? What did I do with it? Here it is. I got a tin bronze scythe. I found that in a treasure pot or whatever, or one of the ruins. I was getting these cobblestones and I popped one of those open and I, out came this. Now, I believe all, the only thing it really does is it clears out grass type materials uh, in a wider area. But it is cool to have. I mean, in fact, I think I'm going to put it up on the tool rack because I think it'll look better. 
All right, let's put it up here. Let's see, is there room for it on here, or is it? Nope. Well, I'll put that there. And then we'll put this back here, and I'll put the extra spear right there. All right, we got extra tools, and I think I might be putting a couple of more for storage here late here soon. But anyway, it's coming along. It's got a nice straw or hay floor and a straw roof. I mean, it's nothing fancy, but it's home. <laughs> and I've managed to find quite a few things along the way. I mean, I you know I've got uh, I got extra flint here, but an extra cobble. Let me see if I can find what I'm looking for here. Oh, here's my uh, prospect pick tool mode that I already fired. Also found some lead. Not sure what to do with that just yet. And here's some quartz chunks and clear quartz. So eventually we can smelt that down and make some windows finally. But the big thing here is I've got seeds and we are going to have managed to get some cabbage seeds too in one of those pots. But we've got a lot going on here, guys. I have got to get either some coal or charcoal, and I didn't realize. Now, Dula told me how to do this, and I believe in just in his last video he did it, or at least started it. But we're going to make a coal pit. Now, it takes a lot of daggone wood. Now, I'm almost there of having enough wood, and I need to collect some more. So. We're going to go around here. Here's some flint. We're going to go along here and get some more wood. Now, I keep getting um, saplings, and I make sure that I replant so that these can grow back, and we'll have so far to go to get more. Okay. Always a good plan if you don't have to go too far. Now let me see. Yeah, I've kind of eradicated most of the trees near me. Oh, looks like that one just popped up. And it's a big tree. Uh, I'm not so sure my axe is going to be able to handle this, but let's see if we can do it. If we can do it, it'll probably be just enough wood to make this work. It might work. There we go. All right, let's see if we can do something with that. We've got this. Oh, I always get those switched. And our axe is gone, but it just was able to to do what we needed needed it to do. All right, let's see how far can we get this filled up. You gotta hit shift to get to place the wood. Ah, we're just gonna be sh just a little shy. Well, the monsters are coming out, and <laughs> that's not good. And actually, I probably am going to need this for firewood so that I can cook a few things. All right, let me get some dirt in there. Now, one thing is if I use dirt for any utility type purpose I always use the low fertility I'm, if I get medium fertility I save it because eventually we're going to be making a garden but we are going to go ahead and get this fire going again and oh, I don't know why I have that oh, that's alright let's see can I cook carrots by the way I wonder if I can oh I forgot, I still had that anvil mold in there. I made an anvil mold, which I need to get enough copper to fill. I've been looking for a cave that has copper in it. I did find one once, but I, shoot, I didn't mark it, and because of that, I can't find it again. <laughs> it's, isn't that typical? But... I don't know if this will cook or not. I don't think the carrots will cook. Because some things, when you cook them, they, they do you more good. 
But yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and put this anvil mode in here. Okay, I don't have room in there. Okay, I do have room in there. So let's move that over here. Also have some medium fertility, medium fertility soil, which I want to save. Here we go. Not the low. There we go. And this knife's just about bit the dust. All right, guys. There's not a whole lot we can do this late. I'm going to go ahead and eat a little bit, wait it out, and then as soon as the sun goes down, go out. It looks like I got one of those guys down there now. Actually, we might go ahead and aggravate a few of them here, <laughs> just for fun and giggles. I've been trying hard to get a gear, temporal gear, so that I can change my spawn point. But yeah, as you can see, and shift, holding your shift button will keep you from falling off, just like in Minecraft. I, did. I was so glad of that. Ooh, looks like I got more than one here. There's one down. chicken shit <laughs> okay there's another one coming yeah this is a great way to ah damn it I broke my darn spear it's all right it's all right I got another one and I think I'm gonna go ahead and make up some torches too while I'm at it cuz I'm not gonna use all my sticks But yeah, this higher platform really does actually keep me pretty safe. So, we're going to make some torches and light it up down there. Now, it's not going to be a permanent thing. They do go out after a while, unfortunately. But, here's one. Actually, I'm going to put that one in my hand so that I can see any see where I'm going and what I'm doing in the dark. Now, for some reason, the torches don't die out when they're in your hand, which is interesting. Okay, there we go. Let me eat me a carrot here. All right, let's put a torch down there so we can kind of see what we're doing. pretty safe down here. I think eventually I will replace this stuff with cobble, but for now, I'm going to leave it as it is. I thought I had a... yeah. There we go. This is my backup spear. Basically, I poke them in the face and they back up. Alright. There. Boy, I got the party going on out here, don't I? Holy crap. Yeah, they'll run like chickens when they start getting too close to death. I think I got anything out of any of those. That keeps happening to me. It's really aggravating. Mm. Oh, there's a couple more down here. Ah. Well, that didn't last long, did it? Yeah. 
I'm definitely gonna have to make a copper spear soon. Alright, let's go ahead and sleep this off. And we'll... Go down and take care of business. And it's morning. Rise and shine. Let's see, how much axe do I have left? I don't have any axe, so I do have an extra axe here. And I have enough knives. I'm not going to take that anywhere. Go ahead and grab these torches. But we are going to go down here and see if... Our, our little friends left us anything when they died. Well, no, I don't think they did. I think they all just died and left nothing. Bastards. Anyway, <laughs> there was one thing I wanted to check out too, guys. I have something on the map that I really want to check into. But first, let me go ahead and eat a little bit. Get that carrot. That way I can make a little room in my inventory. But on the map... And I, as you can tell, I've explored a little bit here. But there is something I want to check out. And it was way down here. And I've got... I'm trying to remember where I put the waypoint. It was an interesting place, to say the least. Now I can't find the waypoint. What the heck happened to the waypoint? Was it that? Ah, here it is. It's called, it's an abandoned mine. I happen to have discovered, I don't know if it's actually a mine, but it is, looks something like one from Minecraft. But we are going to head on down there and see if we can't find it again. But before I do that, I better get a spear going. I'll tell you, that's not a good thing to be without a weapon. The wolves will wreck you pretty bad. Our spear here. I'm going to put that up here. Make sure I'm going to move all this stuff over. Keep the dirt there, and I'm going to put the firewood here because I might need it if I get stuck out overnight. Alright, let's head on over there. We have got, let's see, let's check the map. Which direction am I going? I need to go this way a little bit more. It's actually more southwest. There's the trader. There's no trader there. <laughs> yeah, that was kind of weird. Apparently, there's supposed to be a trader there, but he's not there. Ooh. Growing spelt. I'll have to come back and get that. We are going to keep on heading down that. Looks like a good place to mine. There's a chicken. A chick, 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 chicken. There's also some kind of a ruin down here. That's pretty cool to look at. Yeah, here it is. It looks like something out of Stargate or something. It's kind of freakish looking. Huh. 
thought I'd take at least take a look at it and see if there's anything. Maybe a pot or something. Ooh, grab that. But I don't think there is. I might come back and dig at it a little bit. But right now we've got a mission. We're going to keep on keeping on. Ooh. This is a nice looking little cave. Nothing back there though. And I'm really, really trying hard to find some copper in one of these mines. Because if I could do, I'm going to make another waypoint and I am going to be doing some serious searching. Alright, we are... Okay, we're getting in wolf territory here. We better be careful. As I tell you, I've been seeing a lot of wolves out there by me. It's kind of weird. But this is some kind of a... Like, limestone desert. There's a black one, and then there's this sandstone. Ooh, more runs. Oh yeah, I got trapped up there. <laughs> All right, let me see. There's the waypoints this way. Yeah, I think I might grab some of the sand too while we're here. There's another ruins. Ooh, 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 ooh. There we go. Let's see. What do we get? What kind of goodies did we get? We got rye seeds and I guess rye seeds. <laughs> no, that's all we got. Well, it was as, wasn't as impressive as I would hope to be. I think we did get this. No, I think I already had the flint knife. Well, we got rye seeds. Eh. I think I already have some rye. That's all right, though. Just hoping for something a little bit cooler. Anyway, let's keep going. It's right over here where that blue dot is there should be an entrance over here somewhere don't tell me I'm not going to be able to find a daggone thing ah here it is but this looks like an interesting looking cave but here's what I'm talking about. This is some seriously interesting stuff here. I want to put a torch in here, but I don't know what you, all you can do with this, but it looks interesting. I figured since I had my axe, but there is something in here. There's a, uh, looks like the, some rawhide. A wooden club. I wonder how you make one of those that could come in useful and a scroll written is a strange alphabet I only if only I knew what secret it holds okay uh oh we've got company here oh temporal gear yes it's about time it's about time let's see I am going to eat some of this black current since he punched me a few times anyway and I am going to well, I'm gonna need <sighs> shoot room is not the best thing that I have at the moment dang on it there we go temporal gear that we're gonna save it seems like we've got some issues here there's another one all right we got rid of him Let's see, is there anything I can drop here? 
Well, this knife isn't all that great. And I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep from getting killed again, if I can help it. So I'm going to put this right here to block. That way they can't come in and kill me. All right, let's see. We've got nothing else. Left, let's see. Shoot, you don't get anything from that? How about this? Ooh, you can get these wooden crates. What could you do with it, though? What can you do with a wooden crate? So little room to store anything. Let's see. We're just going to go ahead and eat some more of these berries. There we go. And this wood could come in handy. Oh, yes. Yes, my friends, that is awesome because this means that I can make a chest. What is that? Large pile of junk metal. I bet you I can melt that down, too. Well, this is a heck of a find, guys. We're going to take all these goodies. thing that I can carry. Oh, let's see. I'm going to drop this dirt. So this is metal parts. Not sure what you can do with it, but I'll take it. Oh, I was afraid that was going to be the case. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. Can't break that. I guess we're just going to have to hang out here for a little bit. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will be back with another episode a vintage story. So until then, guys, I will see you later. Bye-bye.